all look at the video of how the black was enslaved in the Arab slave market, and then you compare to the, the Hajj, when they were circling the Mecca, the whole Mecca is a slave market. They were dancing around the circle, and the Arab man was standing there looking at the woman. Oh, I like this lady. Yeah, I'm going to pick her. Are you married? No? Okay, come with me. Are you married? Yes? Okay, where's your husband? Kill him, and then take him as his wife. Why can't the woman cover their face in Mecca? Why? You want your women naked? Yeah, you want your women Muhammad, naked. Muhammad, you Muhammad said you, you want your women Muhammad naked. Muhammad said women must cover their face, but not you in Mecca. Why? Naked. Because Muhammad is horny. That is the concept of Islam. Liar. Kill, third in wife, kill, third in wife, sex, sex, don't sex, kill, horny, horny, kill. horny. Even if I disagree with Christian, there's a good story. Jesus died for our sin. He sacrificed himself for the greater good so people can understand. So the mind was open, be open-minded. Islam is all about reciting verse. There's no meditation, in, there's no learning concept in, uh, in Islam. It's just, just remembering words, remembering words like a ship, like a zombie. That's all you know. The Islamic way of life is better than your life. The better than your way of life. Do you know why? Do you know why? It has a moral foundation, first of all. Moral, when yes. your religion moral, was formed by right things, right? To you, Go back to the basic, back to the basic. How was Islam created? How was Islam created? Right? Fighting, fighting, listen, listen, fighting. Listen, listen. Don't tell me fighting is a listen, good religion. Listen, first and foremost, religion right? of peace. Spread peace, don't fight. The, the origin of Islam is fighting. When I say that St. John 1, 1 says in the beginning was the Word and the Word was with God and the Word was God, you need to tell me that it's not saying that and if you're saying it doesn't say that, you need to tell me what it is saying. Who is the Word? I want to debunk you again. Let's have a moment later. Because you have to be put in the Old Testament. You don't even know what God says. We're not dealing with the Old Testament. We're dealing with St. John. You have to deal with St. John. Forget about John. And then you go to the Old Testament. See how much in trouble you are? Tell me it's not saying that. Tell me it's not saying that. The words tell me it's not saying that. In the beginning, was the word the and the word was with yeah. God and the word was, was God. him so who is the word what so, so who is the word so who is the word who is the word listen to me listen who is the word who is the word that's my question that is my question for the man that wants to be the head of the Nawa team I'm asking him the question who is the word mommy they should have your wages mommy they should have your wages they should have your wages they should have your wages come back to me this is not this is not the way to go about being the head of the Nawa team it's not for you. Because for 1400 years, Muslims have been able to get away with what you call theological murder by simply saying that the Quran is the word of God and not proving it. And now they've been put through all kinds of tests that they've never been put through before on an academic level, on a theological level, and on a spiritual level. Bob particularly chose one version. For a reason, because that version may be vague, doesn't have the wording clearly. Therefore, we can claim that the Prophet used to cross-dress. But when we go to the other hadith in Sunnah Nisai, it clearly states the Prophet said, I was under the blanket of Aisha. I can't receive a lecture from the marshal of the Dawah team about misrepresenting texts when Adnan, Mansour and Hashim have built a career on misrepresenting Christian texts. Right. I am simply highlighting the inconsistency and hypocrisy and disingenuousness of the Christian missionaries working in the park. They deliberately come here and lie to people, not only to Muslims, to even their own audiences. He's earned for himself more punishment in hell because in Muslim circles calling someone a missionary is malicious, it's a negative term. I am not a missionary, so he has lied about me. And according to hadith literature, according to, according to the science of hadith, you can't trust a liar, so you can't trust Adnan. So there was no other garment under which the revelation came except the garment covering on bed of Aisha. Why would he? Because Show me where it says under. bed. Okay. Where does it say no, bed? It, no. In the Arabic language. Does it okay. say bed? And then Adnan said, well, this word could mean any of these things. So in other words, the Muslims are choosing the translation that suits them best. Adukin. Adukin. Jesus is Lord. Christ the Lord. Jesus is Lord. Christ the Lord. They are choosing the translation that suits them best. And the reason why they are choosing the translation that suits them best is because they are trying to free their prophet from embarrassment.
Your book yeah. actually, actually orders the killing of babies who are suckling so, on the breast so, of so, their mothers. So Allah. Okay. Is that a book of mercy? It is reported on the authority of Sabin Jafimah that the Prophet of Allah, when asked about the women and children of the polytheists being killed during the night raid, he said they are from them. He showed no concern to women and children being being killed. If, if the people who are attacking Muhammad, they, no, they catch, no, no, this was the night raid me, where they went to the people, not you, the people came can, to... Can you, can you please me? You're, you're changing, the, you're twisting no, no, it. I'm not because not. it says if they ask for peace, yeah. then accept it. But when you're in the majority, so that means when now you're beating yeah. them yeah. and they're asking yeah. for peace, yeah. you do not give them the same they that you have no asked mercy. for when they will be to they you. Okay. Where is the mercy? The Jesus come to oh, Allah to answer, ask them. Answer what's in your Quran. Yeah, I'm talking about, about, about the Bible. No, 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 no. I asked about your Quran. Okay. Michael, Michael, my conversation is finished. My conversation is finished. He can't answer the question. This debate is over because you cannot answer. You have said but your book says that you don't, don't believe. Like you have you're, said you're, you're that you don't babies. believe in taking are, women as war babies. But your book says you can kill babies. And you don't How believe can you talk to me? in How can you having talk to me? sex with your, slaves. Your book says you can kill babies. So was Muhammad right or wrong? When he permitted it. Shush! Okay, shush! Shush! Don't talk about the Bible. Oh, you're talking about morality, yes? Talk, you're talking about morality. Hadith and Hold on, how can you speak to me when your book says. No, no, no. Your book. He's not answering the question. Bob, 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 you don't answer the question. Your book says you can kill. Answer the question. There's nothing you can. Was Muhammad right or wrong? Answer. Are you going to let me? Ashamed of their own prophet. Yeah. Is the Dawa team ashamed of their own book? Yeah. They are ashamed to defend their own religion. Yeah. Because their religion is shameful. Yeah. Ali Dawa is a man who talks about masturbating over babies. And it's a record. And it's on record. Ali Dawa is a self propagandist who endangered an innocent family because of his words against Tommy Robinson. Ali Dawa! Ali Dawa! Stop running away! Ali Dawa! Stop running away! Violent Muslims can't control themselves, don't like free speech. They don't like free speech, so what do they do? They come to Speaker's Corner. You couldn't make this shit up. Well, you, 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 families have got police outside their house because of you. Why am I even listening to you? Families are fearful of their lives because of you. Why would I even listen to you? You're a joke. You publish someone's address and they've got police 24 hours outside their front door because you risked the health of them because you thought Tommy Robinson lived there. I am not Tommy Robinson. If I was Tommy Robinson, I would not be wasting my breath with you. Steve, run away. Do what Tommy does. Do what Tommy does. Do what Tommy does. You're a no one. Do what Tommy does. Who are you? I'm a no one. Who are you? Who Tommy Robinson has three videos for. You're a no one. You're a publicity seeking twit. You're a publicity seeking twit. You know why he's saying that? Because you know Tommy Robinson's cameraman Lucy? You know Lucy, right? 
And your oh. point is what? And I know Tommy, Tommy Robinson! You know and I know Jack Buckley! You know who Lucy is? And what's your Tommy problem? Tommy Robinson, cameraman! Oh. Camera, she's a woman, she's a woman! And you know Lucy, because you said... And what? You, know, you are a fantasist! Yes. Someone that you don't even know what the word means, really. No, 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 no. Really, come on, okay, come person, on. You don't know what the word fantasist okay. means. Well, it's someone who lives in their own little fantasy world yeah. Yeah. and believes all sorts of nonsense. Don't say that so, for example, Robinson. Lucy Tommy Brown Robinson said to him, yeah. she tweeted to the entire well, tweeted, world. I, I know Lucy. Okay. You don't Lucy. know her, like um, you don't know Tommy Robinson, because you're a no one. The fact of the matter is, he has not shown the Shahada. He hasn't, and now he's running away. He hasn't shown the Shahada. He hasn't shown the Shahada. I asked him to show me the Shahada, and he hasn't done it. You didn't let him. You didn't let him. I'll give you another chance. Show me in the Quran. Show me. Three out of the Islamic Dawah team running from one debate. Three, three, Ali Dawah, they're all running, what's You're wrong with them? Here. This is well, the first principle of your beliefs. Surely it would be in the Quran. So you haven't got it? No evidence. A really simple question and Shamsi doesn't have any evidence of what he believes. I've asked three members of the Islamic Dawah team to debate me on Islamic Taweed. I asked Ali Dawah. The debate that I want to talk about is about Thank you. Islamic Taweed. Okay. Do you want to debate that, yes or no? No. No. Okay, yeah. guys, I'm going to find someone who wants to go. debate Islamic Thank Taweed. You. I asked Hashim. Yes. He made an excuse about the cameras not being ready. He's saying what you're saying about his camera. He's got a lovely uh, phone back. He, he's part of the Islamic <laughs> Dawah team. He can record you. Look, Bob. Come on. I, will you record no, no. anyone else other than Sophie? Hashim. 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 The camera's ready. Hashim. The camera's ready. Hashim. The camera's ready. Hashim. The camera's ready. Hashim. Do you want to debate Taweed? Hashim. 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 The camera's ready. You can hear us. Come on. No. Oh, do you see? Oh. 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 I'm gonna go pray, come back to you in a condition you don't be able to so, and so, like so do you see, he doesn't want to debate you know you to run. As it says in scripture, if you stand against the devil, the devil flees. Ali, the one for me, when you were firm, you masturbated over a baby. That was bad, Ali. Masturbating over babies? Masturbating over babies? I don't think so. What did you think about your humiliation with Tommy Robinson? Humiliation. Ali was bad, though. Okay. We all agree it was bad, innit? Yeah, 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 terrible. It was good. And what is this masturbating over babies? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why you do that, Ali? Ali, why you do that? You're embarrassed, aren't you? Ali, you're embarrassed, aren't you? Ali, you're embarrassed, aren't you? Ali, you're embarrassed, aren't you? Now, you shed Shia laws above the law in, of the land, of this country. So, would you have a no limit on the on the age of consent or the age that you can rape someone because you because that's what you can do is rape a child you, a child cannot consent don't you think that's terrible yeah six-year-old aisha masturbating over babies muhammad went up muhammad went up on the white horse no but this is what he said on camera i couldn't believe he said it have you anything to say, Ali? No, I'm, sure, I'm just reading the Quran. I want to be productive yeah, you in my time. Yeah, you do, yeah, yeah, but you did. I have to be productive in my it, time. It's, it's funny how the table is telling you now. I'm not sure you have nothing to say, have you? Trying so, wearing a Quran, could that say? Trying to be productive here. Yeah. Could that you could masturbate over a baby? Yeah. What does it say you could masturbate over a baby? Yeah. And what does it say in the Quran that you can sleep with children? Ali, you embarrassed yourself last week, this, this week. I warned you last week not to do it. My final advice for you is your face now. It's going to be all over the far right media. 
do not go past any football club matches. Chelsea, Millwall, give any of those group catches you in any pub, you're finished. You should have done it, Ali. You're a marked man. I warned you, I tried to help him. Like, you didn't know, listen. You heard me giving advice, didn't you? You didn't listen. Now, who are you speaking to? A lawyer? You don't need one, I'm here. No, no, I'm, but I'm not going to help you. Heard. Yeah, Hans will say he wants to know the name of Jesus in the Old Testament. But yeah, he can't show me in the Quran where the name of Muhammad is supposed to be prophesied in the Bible. You can't control your Christian missionary No, I'm not here to control it. Oh, you're not? Second. So don't cry. Why are you pointing? Why are you complaining about him pointing? And now he's pointing. I'm not pointing, but he can't point. Double standard, Hamza. I am asking. Where in the Quran it says Muhammad is prophesied in the Old and New Testament? I'm going to repeat again. I don't come every week, so I've not made this claim every week. The last time I was here was two months ago. So please don't ask me to answer something that I've not made a claim about. Already he's running. Already he's running. He gets paid for this, by the way. Ah, I would ask for a refund if you're one of his sponsors. I'm coming in. First thing, you asked me a straw man question. I asked you a direct question, not a straw man question. It's a logical fallacy, mate. My claim is never based on you as a person. It is based upon the arguments made by the Dawa team week in, week out at Speaker's Corner. I'm going to say it one more time, right? It's running. It's not running, is it? How's it running? Do you know what a straw man argument is? I know that you, know you are is running. What is a straw man? What's I know what you're running. What's a straw man? When you answer my question, I'll answer yours. There we go, there we go. So this straw is man point. argument is asking someone to answer a claim they never made. Deflection. Is he logical, mate? Deflection. Ladies and gentlemen. You're a madman. I have never you're said. You're a madman. Jason, Jason, I have never said, said, said in this that Georgia. Hamza, as an you'll individual, <laughs> has made this claim. Stop running from the question. And if you want to be in, tag in. Stop interrupting. No, For the fifth time, where in the Quran does it say Muhammad is spoken of in the Old or New Testament? It doesn't. Thank you. So that's it. No, no, no. I've always loved this tradition of Speaker's Corner, which seemed very British to me. But I have come only to see that this tradition, the tradition of freedom of speech in the UK, is dead. My last refuge was Speaker's Corner. I remembered my mother telling me about that special place when I was a child. It seemed almost magical to me. A place where everyone, without admission, could just stand on a box and start to speak to those who wanted to listen. Who is the sovereign in this country? It's you, the people. 
You, the silent and invisible majority who said no during Brexit. You can say no again. No to Islamisation. No to mass immigration. The message to the Home Office, to the police, to the security services. You may stop the speaker. Today proved you will not stop the speaker. Um, medical evidence that shows that camel urine helps you. Show, show us, show us. Show us. Medical, can I show you this? Medical, 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 first, can I show you medical this? no, show us medical, um, um, medical evidence that shows camel urine um, actually heals you and is good for your health. It's a Muslim university. It's a Muslim university. Of course they're going to say that. University, you joke oh, they're they're lying. Lying. You're biased now. You're biased. Oh, Every Muslim Islamic scholar, everything they're all biased. They believe the Quran. Listen, man. Muslims who read that hadith during the outbreak of the MERS virus, if they had not read that news, would continue and proceed to consume camel urine, and therefore would become diseased. Following the words of your prophet. As a precaution, World Health Organization is urging people to avoid drinking raw camel milk or camel ah! urine. As disgusting as this sounds, some people in Muslim countries believe drinking camel urine will cure ailments. <laughs> While the outbreak persists, who is advised so to follow basic common sense right? when it comes was to right? hygiene? No, no, because 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 you won't let me lock you down on the god thing because no, no, no. you're running around. No, 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 no. Look, for God's sake, it's so simple. I have reasons to believe something. I don't have any reasons not to believe something. So you believe it? So that doesn't make me delusional. I, however, do not hold the belief that I believe in God and this counterfactual evidence. I may be no, no. I may be wrong, but I'm not delusional. You're not. You're okay. not ready to accept being delusional okay. because you hold on to these principles to be true. These, these delusions or these, this book to be true. But, but, but the book, but the book is. No. Subjective book. No. In your philosophy, is, every, is everyone Muslim? When you're mentioning it, sounds, no. it sounds like. No. So I've heard Muslims here say everyone's born Muslim. I don't believe that. No one believes that. No one believes that. Any, Adam, any, I don't know what kind of Muslim any, you are, you know. What kind of Muslim are you, Adam? You don't any, that Adam, what kind of Muslim are you, bro? Any, the, one that, the one that you haven't met. That's what. So. You don't believe in Sharia, then? I don't believe in Sharia law, no. We don't know what kind of Muslim you is, you know. We don't know what kind of Muslim you is. Right? You can title this the philosophical Muslim. You can title that the philosophical Muslim. The delusional, but I think the delusional, the delusional philosophical Muslim. Muslim. Is a better <laughs> Go on. Title. Mary looked after God Almighty. That means Mary fed God Almighty. That means that Mary used to put God on clothes of God Almighty. Yeah. That means you believe that when Jesus was a boy and he went out and played yes, yeah. Mary used to say to the master of the universe, yeah. make sure you come back in at nine o'clock. That's right. And, and if God didn't come back in on time, you would get into trouble. Right. If he wanted to come for 33 years, down as a man just so we could sort some stuff out in the world just so we can make some people understand because maybe not everyone would have listened if it was God maybe not everyone would have listened if he came down and said I am God 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 because everyone would have thought oh this guy's arrogant it's clear Muhammad makes up verses as he hears them it's not being revealed from God I can ask any Christian here attempt. right now this is does God attempt. reveal verses little bit by little bit he reveals it that's it he doesn't change his mind so what is happening, they're in a crowded room. Allah's given um, Muhammad a revelation that everyone has to do jihad. A blind man has come up and said, what about me? And then Allah's given him another revelation. It says you are a donkey. What does it say in context? And it says you are a foolish. What does it say in context? Right, what else? You are a donkey. You are a fool. Context. The Bible says you are born like a donkey. Am I right or wrong? No. Yes. You no. Way. See it. Do you see the kind of misreadings? Please bring it out. Yes. For he knows false men and he sees iniquity without investigating. An idiot will become intelligent when the foul 
of a wild donkey is born a man. So the point that this brother was misquoting is the fact that the characters in the book of Job are stating that a man who believes that he can penetrate the mystery and the depth of God and the mysteries of God says, as a fool and only such a fool would become intelligent when a donkey is born of a man. Wild In other words, wild since wild no donkey will be born of a man, no, no man can fully understand God. You have been exposed have no for the ignorant man you are, as well as a man lacking, lacking any etiquette at all. We got, we got mixed show. Yeah, I know it's prized by hecklers. Where it this says is Hamid Hamid is prophesied in the Bible. Mixed hacking team. Hamza. Hamza. Why are you scared, man? You're mixed hacking team. We're in the middle of a discussion. I'm paying you. Answer the question. Where does it say it? Paul. Hamza, you asked the Christian brother a question. I'm asking you a question about the Quran. Okay, so basically. In the Quran, where does it say Hamid's name? The Christians come here to hackle in the Bible. They can't have a normal discussion. This. They come to hackle. Nothing. What? Nothing, Hamza. <laughs> Why are people paying you to do that one? How many gold, mate? How many gold? <laughs>